Oh, Miss Farmer, your words just aren't as effective as Chekhov's. But your ability as an actress, not bad. Are you with us? There's a play I'm directing, Ellie and Corn. I want you to try out for the lead. Just exactly what are your intentions, Miss Rosenstein? <laughs> the group theater. I want you there. That's the group theater. What am I going to do with you? The group is the home of Odette, Kingsley, Maxwell Anderson, Luther Adler, Lee Strasberg, Harold Corman, the great creative minds of this country. They're all there. This is as close to Moscow as I can get. I want you working with writers who who write from their guts, who aren't afraid of Karl Marx or anyone with original thoughts. People who are dedicated to ideas, who work for something bigger than themselves, who don't conform, who refuse to be bought by Hollywood. Oh, I know, I know. Hollywood, corrupt her, the creative spirit. <laughs> you don't belong here, you belong in New York. It's a new world, Admiral Francis. Don't be afraid. Roosevelt's world. Equality and socialism will never get soaked up again like Damn, Mama. Roosevelt's just trying to get people back to work. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He's not content to be president. Oh, he wants to be king. Sophie says he's going to save the Sophie country. again. He drives too fast. She talks too fast. She's a lot like you. I beg your pardon. Well, she believes women have minds and should use them. Don't pull at the roots. You will send them right into shock. Sophie's the smartest woman I've ever met, Sophie, Mama. Sophie, 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 whatever happened to Lottie? She didn't have a brain in her head, but at least her motives were sincere. Sophie doesn't have motives. Of her sort. What sort? People of her kind. Are we talking religion, Mama? Are we? Apparently we're not talking. day, nice women did not puff on sticks of tobacco. Ah. You certainly do have a green thumb, Mrs. Farmer. Well, now that you're all grown up, you don't have to listen to me. College girls know it all. I would hate to see what your lungs look like. I'm sure Sophie Rosenberg taught Rosenstein. you that, too. Taught you that, too. I do not approve of pushy females. Oh. <coughs> Blow that smoke in my direction. What is so funny? <laughs> well, you're not exactly a shrinking violet, Mama. I speak out when it is necessary, but I don't push. Sadly, do you want me to be a newspaper woman, Mama? You'll have to choose your own occupation. Just be sure you choose one. Suppose I were to become, say, an actress. I mean, I know that's a ridiculous idea, but no. Not at all. Not? No. Then if I were to transfer to the drama department, maybe you'd be pleased? Maybe I'd be. Yes. What is so funny? What's going on here? And how long has it been going on? Long enough for me to get the lead in Alien Corn? Ha, <laughs> ha, 